Hey what's up guys this is Sohan and you are watching your technical spark channel friends since you are watching this video i am pretty sure that you are facing some issue with your usb drive partitions which is very common and guys i'll help you to remove those partition from your usb device so how we can do that let me show you by connecting my one usb drive to my pc okay connected see i got total to drive when I connected my single USB. So in this video, I will show you step by step how you can get rid of this. And guys, let me tell you by and basically how exactly these two drives comes. So in my case, I try to create one bootable uh, drive where I have kept Windows 11 bootable file into my USB drive. But while creating this bootable drive, the another UEFI drive is got automatically created. And if I try to you know just simply format or anything to do with this my uh, particular secondary drive then there is nothing is happening let me show you okay and then it's formatted okay so there's nothing happened to this drive it will stay as it is now let me tell you how you can remove this and make it as a one single drive okay so get rid of this right click on your windows button and choose windows powershell Once PowerShell is open, then there are certain commands which we need to follow here. Let me just keep this side by side so that you guys will be able to watch it very clearly. Let me just, yeah, perfect. Now very first command which we need to run is disk part. Once you type the command, click on enter. As you could see, my disk has been selected on my computer which is T1. So T1 basically is my computer name. Let me show you by going into this uh, properties here you go guys my device name or you can say computer name is t1 now let me close this now second command we have to run which is list disk and click on enter so there are total two disks which is connected to my pc the first disk is 40 gb as you could see in 40 gb i have created two partition one is 34 and one is 5 so total are 40 GB and the second disk which is disk number one that is my USB pen drive or you can say flash drive now the next command we have to run is which is select disk and the disk number one we have to type so I have to enter that now click on enter disk one is now selected and guys if in case you want to view what is inside the exact disk to make sure that you are selecting correct disk so then what you can do you just have to type one command that is detail disk and hit enter so perfect guys so i have selected proper disk to perform my further operation so my usb pen drive is manufacturer is kingston data traveler and in that there are total two volumes are available one is windows 11 that is this one and another is uefi that is this one so now next command we have to run is clean so that both the partition will get clean so for that command is clean now type the command as a clean and hit enter this spark succeed in cleaning the disk and as soon as i have select you know run this command my both the partition has been gone from my this pc you can check out here okay now let's type the next command so next command is we have to create the partition so for that command is create partition primary and hit enter as you could see it has created one single partition so earlier there are total two partition were present so it deleted both the partition with our clean command and when we run this command it has created one partition now friends the further command we can uh, you know do it from powershell as well as our gui like if you double click on this it will ask you to format so you can directly simply click on format here like this and provide the your volume name and other details like battery to how exactly you want to format your pen drive or let me close this yeah now or you can simply type one command here that is format efs space is equal to space ntfs quick so this command will also work for you to format your usb drive so instead of going with the GUI, what I am doing, I am formatting my USB drive using 
PowerShell. So let me hit enter. And here is the percentage, like how much my pen drive has been formatted. Perfect. Within a second, my pen drive format has been completed. And now it's showing only one drive instead of two. Let me open this. Let me create one text file. Yeah, it's pretty much working. Let me type something. Save this file. Yeah, now it's become one KB. Now let me exit from my PowerShell. So that command is exit and hit enter. So I'm out of my dispart window. Let me write exit again, close. It's got closed automatically. So friends, I hope now you have understood how you can delete your UEFI partition from your USB disk. It's very simple and easy. Now friends, as always, if you found this video useful, then please click on the like button and don't forget to share. If in case you are a new viewer on my channel, then consider subscribing because I am uploading lots of useful content on this channel. So that's it in this video. This is Sohan signing out.